future, we might be able to try to do the I whole bet thing. you didn't know this. Like, um, we're gonna do the free play. We're gonna try to get 100% because my sponsor has an offer for me. My sponsor, excuse that, <laughs> says that we, that if we can get 100% in this game, he will get me Lego, Lego Avengers. He's great. Okay. Well, Dr. Malcolm, here to share a few campfire stories with my uncle. I was there, I know what happened, and so do you. Ingen is my responsibility now, Doctor, and I will jealously defend its interests. Oh. You were right and I was wrong there. Did you ever expect to hear me say such a thing? Isla Nubla was just a showroom, something for the tourists. Site B was the factory floor. That was on Ina Sauna. A few weeks ago, a British family on a yacht cruise stumbled across the island. The boarders used the incident to take control of Injun from me. Okay, so there's another island with dinosaurs, no fences this time, and you want to send people in? I need a complete photo record of those animals. You didn't contact Sarah. She'll be fine. And believe me, the research team was not a research expedition anymore. It's a rescue operation, and it's leaving right now. You can't shave three days off my deadline. Expect everything to be ready. I'm not fully supplied. I haven't field tested any of this stuff. All right, people, we're going nowhere until we get these vehicles fixed up. Okay guys, now we can play as Ian Malcolm, first of all, and Eddie Carr. So, let's see, um, so there are targets, so maybe Eddie Carr has the, Trent has the range weapon ability, so we can shoot the tranquilizer darts, and... What's this? Oh, is there a ride on wheels? That's odd. Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna go left, and let's see what we're doing. Why is this happening? Honestly, guys, I have no idea what's happening. We've gotten stuck in there. Press triangle to ride up Lego tires. So let's go ride up Lego tires. And let's get this car set up. I need half air on the tires here, guys. All right. So. Wait, did I need that tire? No, I did. Let me check. Oh, he has a lever. Here's his tire. A lever. Actually, that's a gold mini here. Awesome. Okay, let's grab this tire and grab it to the other side. Uh, I have no idea what's happening. Why it's shrinking? Apologies for the incidents. I have no idea why. Howie, oh, I got a splinter! From rubber? Just get in the car. Thank you. 
Can't see anything. No. Just dried paint. Okay, guys, I'm back, and we have our footage that we can actually use. So, in this situation, we need you. Skills to find out what colors make green, and the answer obviously is yellow. And wait, did I do it? Did I do it? Okay, got it. Okay, we're almost there. Oh wait, um, uh, let's go over here. Go over here. Looks like I made green, I think. So, uh, we stand on this. Oh, there we go! <coughs> Sorry. Oh, it's in my mouth. Ew. Okay, at least we got oh, the... Hey, I got it on the car, too! Another car? Fixed. That's the second car. We can find a way to get the third one. <laughs> Don't know if that's working. It looks like that's working. Oops. I did not know you. Bits to stay in. Can y'all give it a try? Only engineers carrying that, can, such as him, can repair broken Lego objects. So that means he can fix this. Oh, a wrench! I, see, I used the mallet. See, that explains it. Dummy. Hey, hey! She's purring like a kitten! A really, really loud kitten. <laughs> oh, thanks. Okay, get those vehicles out onto the dock. We gotta sort out that mobile lab next. Come on, hustle! Looks like we did it. Yo, look where you're driving! Thanks for the two-minute warning, Eddie. Nick Van Owen, this is Ian Malcolm. Nick's our field photographer. Ian is our... Ian. Okay, guys, we have Nick Van Owen unlocked. Okay. 
Let's just collect these studs. Let's see what he has. Just left the bash attack and nothing else. What do we need some extra car? Oh wait, we need a truck. A big giant truck. Oh, just I love to teach. Sturdy object like a monkey bear killed by him can be used to force and open Lego doors by pressing. It worked. Could break it, sure. It's not like you'll have to fix it later. <laughs> Whew. It's no use. That engine ain't budging. You got any idea how to push that in without pulling a hamstring? Oh man, I never should have taken home the engine hoist to shift my couch. Safety? Sheesh. We got a push and pull level switch. Whoa! Switch. I never would have thought to do that. That's it. Keep pushing. Looks like it's working. All right. So. Okay. Okay. Stop. She's home. Thanks. This is a high, high, high. You know, you go up and you hide. High. Actually, it's put him in a very convenient fighting height. Okay, guys, I think we have, uh, I don't know what that was. Oh, wait, it was the dinosaur fossil for each level. So that's also part of our 100%. So without further ado, guys, let's go up here and let's see what happens. I'm impatient, let me out. I'm impatient, let me out. Ow, ow. The landing. Okay, uh, Nick, we need your help. So, we should wrench that open. There we go. We got another mini kit. It's two mini kits, guys. Another part of our 100% walkthrough. Okay. Looks so, like any car might be needed for the snow. And does he end up? No. So maybe I just. Yeah. Let's hold this. Monkey wrench. Smash, smash this. There. Grab the studs here. Looks like I guess he. Uh, no, I can't smash that. Let's go down here and see what happens. Okay, so we got another switch that might be used for a future uh, character. Is someone meant to be putting a roof on the mobile lab? Or is it meant to be an open top? You know, it might rain on the island. At the very least, we should consider making it a convertible. Let's see, do I need to get here? No. Oh, I get it. There's a switch up here. I just need to find a way to get up there. Okay, so we're going to build our way up on the next episode. Stay tuned for Jurassic Park The Lost World Episode 2. I'll speak to you guys next time.